Ducks and geese are similar in appearance, and many people mistake one for the other. Ducks and geese, along with swans, are birds that belong to the family Anatidae. While there are a few key similarities, there are also distinct differences between these two bird types. So, what's the difference between a duck and a goose? These two types of birds live very different lives, especially depending on their individual breeds and ages. They both have webbed feet and broad, flat beaks and favor living in small flocks. Let's look at the similarities between these two waterfowl and the key differences. Nine, size and weight. The main difference between ducks versus geese lies in their difference in size and weight. Geese are much larger than ducks and they have elegant long necks compared to the average length of a duck's neck. Ducks tend to have shorter legs which are set further back on their body. The average duck, depending on species, weighs anywhere from 2 to 5 pounds, while geese weigh double that. Ducks often grow anywhere from 15 to 20 inches in length, while geese reach 30 to 50 inches, depending on the specific breed. Eight, characteristics and appearance. Geese live in various habitats, though they always tend to live close to water, including wetlands, marshes, streams, and lakes, and they can be found on every continent except Antarctica. There are around 29 species of geese around the world, generally found in Asia, North America, and Europe. Include Canada goose, swan goose, grayleg goose, brant goose, cackling goose, greater white-fronted goose, they are migratory birds having extremely strong wings which they use to cover long distances while migrating to the warmer areas. There are many different duck species, but the most common in the United States include mallards, scops, teals, American widgeon. Ducks tend to spend most of their time on the water and inhabit ponds, streams, rivers, and wetlands and can be found on every continent but Antarctica. Ducks are generally docile, social creatures and do not have the aggressive reputation of geese. Seven, Bill. Ducks also have wider and longer bills when compared to geese, and this is likely due to their dietary differences. Ducks have a broad, flat bill which reaches to about eye level and with nostrils that are positioned high up. They use their bill to forage for snails, crustaceans, fish, worms, and aquatic vegetation both in water and on the ground. Geese have shorter, hump-shaped bills with a notch that can reach the top of their heads and with nostrils that are positioned further down. They tend to be herbivores and use their bill to graze on the ground. Six, uses goose and duck. Geese are multipurpose animals and useful birds to have around on small farms. They also make beautiful show birds. They are great foragers and can help keep your lawn trim and free from weeds. They are low maintenance birds in general, certainly less so than ducks.
Geese are notoriously loud and noisy birds, though, which does make them great guard animals because they'll always alert you to any strange new sounds or visitors. <coughs> While geese are not great layers, they only produce around 60 eggs a year. Their eggs are large, nutritious, and delicious, and most species of domestic geese produce tender, premium quality meat. Ducks are highly useful animals that are used for meat, eggs, and feathers. Besides their delicious meat, ducks are far more prolific layers than geese, and in captivity, they can lay an egg every day or two in the right conditions, making them ideal for small homesteads as an alternative to chickens. They have a short breeding period but can lay up to 60 to 100 eggs during that period. Five, diet. Ducks are known for their omnivorous diets. Geese are primarily herbivores. Geese tend to eat plant matter, both in and out of the water. Ducks are omnivores and prefer feeding on small fishes, insects, and aquatic plants. Geese, on the other hand, are herbivores and prefer feeding on small grass. 4. Color True geese tend to be gray, white, or brown, and can be divided into two groups, pale-breasted geese and dark-breasted geese. They all have pink, orange, or yellow bills and legs. Geese are not sexually dimorphic, which means there is little difference between males and females, although ganders tend to be slightly larger, although size is not a reliable indicator of sex. Duck tend to have much more colorful feathers when compared to geese. While it will always depend on the specific breed, the majority of ducks, especially male ducks, have brightly colored feathers and intricate patterns. Three, lifespan. Geese have longer lifespans than ducks overall, living an average of eight to 12 years, while ducks live an average of three to eight years total. Two, communication. The most significant distinction between the two species is their way of communication. <laughs> Ducks make their significant quack noise to communicate with each other, whereas geese make loud honking sounds to communicate. <laughs> One, babies. Duck babies are known as ducklings, whereas geese babies are known as goslings. Can ducks breed with geese? Although waterfowl crossbreed more often than any other family of birds with records of more than 400 hybrid combinations, a duck cannot breed with a goose. Which breed is right for you? If you're looking for an animal that can provide you with abundant, nutritious eggs and healthy, tender meat, ducks are the best choice. However, if you're looking for a beautiful pet bird to have on your homestead, both ducks and geese are great choices. Geese are great alarm systems and will notify you of any strange animals or people. That's all for today. Did you learn anything here? Let us know in the comment.
If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. See you on the next video.